Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Euroconference 2008. For those of you whom I met yesterday evening, I'm Frances Edmonds. I'm your host for the day. And è vero che siamo in Italia. It's true that we are in Italy, but most of you are not Italian. Therefore, we have no right to be 20 minutes late <laughs> at the beginning of the show. I am warning you with a degree of harshness that this will be made up during the course of the day. So please, you know what the agenda is. Let's try and stick to the timetable. We have a truly busy agenda, and I really want to get you to your next gala dinner on time. So if you'll just work with me on this one, I'd be very grateful. A few housekeeping messages before we begin. The big doors at the end of the room will be used just for coming in and out after the plenary sessions. But if during a session you wish to leave the room, please use these lateral doors. That's quite important, the lateral doors over here. Now then, since we are devoting this entire conference to well-being, and since you have come from the four corners of the universe, and I am mindful of your work-life balance, I would ask you at this juncture, please, each and every one of you to fish out of your inside pocket handbag or wherever you locate it, your mobile phone, your BlackBerry, whatever it is that you use. Please locate that now. And because I'm mindful, as I say, of your long distances that you have traveled, worried about your deep vein thrombosis, I want you all to stand up now. Everybody please to stand up, legs akimbo. Okay, in your right hand, please, I want you to place the mobile BlackBerry of your choice. <laughs> yeah. And I want you to extend the other arm equally so that we have a 180 degree line. <laughs> Very good. Isometric exercise. Then in a complete 180 degree arc, I want you to move as, the, as I'm going to move in a moment and turn that mobile off. <laughs> you may now sit down. If in the plenary session we have any infringements of that rule, you will be fined. It's up to Tad to decide what you will be fined, but you will indeed be fined. I will be back with you in a moment, ladies and gentlemen, and after the very spectacular film that we saw last night, and it is so good, we're going to see it again, I shall be handing you over to the very capable hands of Tadza Linden and Alex Ellis. But let's watch that terrific film, that feel-good film again. It truly was a great bit of cinematography. quite as seamless a transition as I had anticipated. My introduce to you, first of all, Tad Zalindan, our Secretary General, and Alex Ellis, our President, for the next Road to Road. You want to talk about the road to Rome and what led us here and how we got here. How was the association started and where did it come from? The conception started many years ago as a French idea and then slowly in Paris in 1997 at the meeting, there were DSPs throughout Europe, quite a few of them. How many, Tad? Uh, roughly 70. Roughly 70 companies came together at the time uh, because the idea of forming a European association was already there. And how to do it was the brainchild that started back there in 1997. What's in a name? We were in Paris. We sorted all sorts of things out in relation to the association. We decided on a working party to go away and think about how the association was going to function. But we also had a few ideas about names. The... Uh, SNPRM, Société Syndicat National des Professionnels de la Relocation et de la Mobilité, suggested. <laughs> suggested that we should call ourselves le Syndicat Européen des Professionnels de la Relocation et de la Mobilité. <laughs> What a wonderful idea. <laughs> 
There was also Prime, Professional Relocation for International Mobility in Europe. There was also Game. Where's Game? I've lost Game. Oh, yes, General Association for Mobility in Europe. And also this very strange IEMF, International Employee Migration Forum. 